Hello everyone, and welcome back to Wolf Quest 3, where we are here with the Dawn Moon Pack Generation 6 as they uh, watch their dinner once away sprint once again i should say sprint away from them oh hey cool and apparently we just tripped over a den i will take that however i would also really like to make sure our wolves had something to eat so let's actually come over and let's actually see if we can be a little bit more clever with how we are going to be hunting this deer since they tend to run in a straight line let's see if we can kind of pace alongside them what the heck is that thing all right, we're getting a little closer. In fact, I think now might be the time. Come on, Callie. I'm <laughs> not Kelly. Oh my gosh. Echo, go, Echo, go. Come on. You even had the benefit of running across a little river right there. Get her. Get her. Come on. Just a little more. Every single time. <laughs> oh, and now we're starting to get tired. So this is just not going to do, especially if we are wearing out our new mate relic. But thankfully, since we have been keeping him happily supplied on a whole bunch of, uh, actually, you know what? Have we been doing a lot of, uh, have we done any no sniff for a while? Relic's like, I would really like to eat the, the food, but he's totally, he's totally patient, which is really cute. <laughs> But yes, friends, welcome back, where we are trying very hard to have our lovely Echo learn a little bit from Relic about what it really takes to go ahead and start claiming Wolfpack territory. Oh my gosh, I don't think we meant to claim this much Wolfpack territory, though. We have pushed our way deep into the lucky, um, the lucky packs territory, and we're actually super far away from the beaver lodge that Echo is actually very partial to. I think she really enjoys hunting beavers. Ooh, there's another den over here. All right, there's just so much to smell, uh, probably because we're in somebody else's territory, which is definitely its own thing. Okay, this was literally us a few minutes ago. That is so funny. All right, well, we'll look for that mule deer. It's not like she's going to be hard to find since she leaves behind tracks and trails everywhere. And we're actually gonna see if we can kind of peck away just a little as we head to the west. Uh, peck away at this territory just a touch. I think we already found this spot. Oh, that's right. And there was something weird smelling over here that Echo actually wanted to go ahead and investigate because she is extremely curious. Not really so curious about the random things that are kind of scattered out in the world like her cousin Kaleidoscope is. Hello, den. So this is the den we ran past. It kind of looks a little cozy. But I don't know if it's going to be a spot, like, that Echo would really want to call home. However, oh, what the heck? <laughs> there was another deer just right over there. All right, all right. We'll give it one last. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. About time. <laughs> Is this the same do do mule deer that we have been chasing for ages now because if it is this is ridiculous and now we're too tired to really chase after it and we're in somebody else's territory this is just i don't think this is gonna work i think we're gonna have to go ahead and give up on this one but i don't like the idea oh there she is though come on she's so healthy curse your wonderful like health and agility how dare you have like survived the fierce winter thus far, probably chewing on all the tree bark. Oh, well. All right, well, I really think actually we should kind of try to get out of here because I don't think this is going to be the best spot for us to be discovered in, especially because I can't really tell. Whoa, Relic, Relic, we really don't have the energy to keep chasing her. And I really think we should actually get out of here because if we're going to try to like claim territory, this is a little deep in the, um, Let's see, yeah, in the Lucky Pax territory, and actually very close to the Van Winkles. So even though that den was interesting, I think that, honestly, Echo is beginning to really lose her taste for deer. They seem to be a lot more trouble than they are worth, even when they have giant groups, like apparently this one. Are you kidding? Like, is there just like a giant herd of mule deer just frolicking over the corner here, happily prancing about and mocking us with our desperate hunger. Ah, <sighs> probably, probably. But I guess there's some bison here. <gasps> oh, another den! Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. And I know we smelled a weird human thing, 
that we might want to do a little bit of investigating, but again, kind of in another PAX territory. Worth trying to weaken a little bit. Yeah, worth weakening, but we're not going to be able to take it over. Not when we're in this condition. So let's just try to get far enough that we don't think the lucky pack will get lucky, unfortunately, and go ahead and sniff out where we're at. Is this where the den is located? Oh no, that was a bunny. 35 minutes ago? Ugh. All right, well. At least right now, we're kind of sneaking behind enemy lines. Ooh, this one. This spot we might be able to take over. Yeah, and if we keep going south from here, we might be able to go ahead and work our way- Oh, there's another weird smelling thing! <laughs> the pink dinosaur! Okay, I think that actually Echo is much, much, much more interested if she's going to be bothered with the human stuff in the town itself. And I think that that's actually perhaps where Relic is beginning to suggest since the other wolf packs. Oh, hello, additional den! I think that one would be kind of boring to Echo. She doesn't strike me as a literally a hole in the ground kind of wolf who enjoys that kind of stuff. All right, a bit further. We might howl in just a second, but again, kind of in the middle of their territory. Ooh, and is, is this all oh, the hot spring? Uh, and unfortunately, I think the beavers will legitimately be like asleep under the, under the ice. They're, beavers are so fascinating that way, you guys. I really just, I love them. All right, that bunny probably split, but do we see it by any chance? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, we can't even outrun a bunny anymore. It is time to get out of here and maybe even just risk it. Oh wait, no, we're about to claim this spot. Yes! <laughs> okay, we're surrounded on all sides by uh, the enemy. However, Let's see if we can find a cozy location. <gasps> Could we actually claim the hot spring? That might be really cool. I wonder if Echo might really like that. Oh, I wonder if there's actually the waterfall somewhere around here. Because if there's like the waterfall, ah, oh, a waterfall somewhere, which I think there might be, I could totally see, what if one of Echo, like Echo or one of her kids like really wants to claim the waterfall area? How cool would that be? Wow. All right, look at this spot. This spot's fun. And it's also kind of warm because of the hot springs. Whoa, so even though it's super loud. Huh, I thought I, I, thought I heard something odd. Let's actually just go ahead. We're going to let the wolves just kind of chill. Like, please don't go in there and like die because that looks kind of dangerous. But I, I think that she actually loves this. I think she would definitely be one of the, the wolves who's just like, a oh, nice warm spot. I'll take it. And I really think that she's starting to legitimately feel like she definitely wants to go ahead and head towards town. I don't know if Callie is actually going to be. Okay. All right. What's happening? Is that literally, um, Hello? Who? Dogs? It was a dog! Oh my gosh! We, we were sniffed out by a pack of dogs! And they were coming to our hot spring? I don't think so. This is our territory now. Echo loves it because it's a nice warm location where she can go ahead and get out of the snow and the cold for just a minute. It's ours now, all other wolves. Like, so back off. Especially because it has this beautiful color. Oh, come on. How could you resist that? The lucky pack, the lucky pack isn't allowed to have this awesomeness. This is way too cool. No pun intended because, you know, it's totally not cool. It's actually a hot spring, but you know what I mean. All right. Oh yeah, these two seem to be enjoying this. I'm enjoying this. Look how pretty it is. Look how pretty. Of course, we're going to go ahead and try to claim some of this. <laughs> Echo, my dear, I think she's very easily taken in by pretty things. Also, we're kind of surrounded on all sides by the other wolf packs. And we're getting kind of hungry. So we might really have to start putting our foot down and actually like doing something about all that. Oh, look, you can... Oh, so there's a bison this way, which is not going to help us unless it conveniently wants to like freeze to death. Moose came over here. 
And other than that, I think, yeah, we're going to keep just kind of heading south. I guess we'll have to try to claim some territory. I'm getting really worried about the whole food thing. So we might have to default to really, really, really working hard to sort of track down. Okay, there's a deer. Okay, this isn't going to go. All right, come on, come on. Maybe one of these deer happened to be a little bit weakened. <laughs> No! No, they look like they've just drank a whole pot of caffeine! Look how fast they are going! <laughs> Zion, this doesn't, doesn't really bode well for us friends. Oh, don't you prance away from me! Don't you even prance to add insult to injury! What is this nonsense? This is just an offense. Like, they're literally practically, like, spitting in our face now. Ugh, and we're hunting in a, the Lucky Pack's territory still. Go, 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 Echo, go, 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 please. Oh, she isn't locked on, that's why. Echo, why? Why must they always be just a little get it, Relic? Go, Relic! Go, Relic! We have got to come up with a better plan. This is just sad. Not only is it sad, but like, there's the other wolves nearby. Oh, please tell me there's a bunny. All right, 10 minutes to go. Went this way. I'll take it. Food, 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 ha ha. All right. Let's go ahead and feed Relic first. Cause he's been really good. Okay, actually, okay, Relic wants to hunt the deer. All right, if we're doing that, Relic, I'm gonna do my best. Yes, I see you two. Oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't. Come on, wolves are endurance runners. <laughs> It ran into our territory. This has to be a lucky sign. Yes! Please! Oh, let this be a lucky sign. Alright, let's wear this deer out. Come on. Let's try to work with Relic. That's right. Chase her into a corner. Even if we're tired. Come on, Relic. <laughs> Maybe this is a sign we are supposed to go ahead and just kind of like claim the area around the hot springs. First solid meal of winter. I will fight her if she will just stand right here. Oh my gosh. All right. Good job, Relic. We're just totally out of energy. Go away, dogs. I am not gonna have this stolen by a bunch of dogs. I refuse. Okay, Relic, hang in there. Okay, and there's just a moose watching on. The drama. There's dog packs behind us. This is still the Lucky Pack's territory, so there's a very good chance they're gonna show up any second and like try to steal the food we literally just got from ourselves from us. Like, this is a bit of a rough start for the Dawn Pack, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, finally! Finally! Where is the territory marker? Their territory marker for over here is very far away. Oh, it's about time. I think this is more or less just gonna top us off though. Look, there's already like a fleet of what I really hope are coyotes. Please let those be coyotes. Please don't let those be like the dogs. Please don't let those be other other mysterious dangers. All right, so at least we are 100% fed. I'm hoping we'll have a little bit of this carcass frozen and left over for even just a second here. Ah, oh, listen to that. I'm... Come on. Alright, okay, we're taking down some of this. Is there not enough carcass left to, like, get the double hell for it to mark it? Because I really want to make sure we don't lose it. Okay, and they're starting to howl back. Are these the dogs? Like, I smell the cow moose. Those are the dogs, aren't they? Are they gonna try to steal our stuff? Okay, very much dislike the idea of the dog stealing our stuff. The wolves closing in on all sides. I love this. This, this is going to be a challenge to be able to like establish our own place, to chase off the dogs. I don't think- I don't think we would want a direct fight, but I do think we wanted to go ahead and try to get these guys to, like, back off. Alright, looks like they're running for it. Cowards, that's right. I hope you run into the lucky pack and they eat you. 
Not that they usually would, but still. Finally! <laughs> All right. What do you mean, fight for territory? Are we fighting for territory? I mean, wait, can the dogs? <gasps> that would actually be so fascinating if the dog pack itself were able to go ahead and they were able to like have their own territory. I know they kind of do with the um, the legends and rumors of the cattle ranch that of course none of our current wolves here in our Dawn or Dark Moon packs know anything about. But still, okay, look, if, if the dogs want to come for us, they have to go through the bison and maybe we can go ahead and have a dramatic finale battle, yeeting them into this, this like sulfur spring. Because for now, I think it's nap time again. <laughs> These two have been through so much already. I love the challenge of this. Establishing the, the name of the Dawn Moon Pack in Lost River is going to be so different compared to anything we have ever done before. And to be honest, after literally dozens, if not hundreds of wolves born across all of our wolf quest adventures, and you guys know there have been a lot of them, I'm really excited. I'm really excited for this sense of something new, this sense of challenge, the way we legitimately, like, look at this, we're losing the territory to the lucky pack. We really have to go ahead and like push hard and get a move on on claiming this. Like, we, we're gonna have to have enough territory before we can even start thinking about having wolf pups. And like having to really legitimately work for it is one of the most thrilling things I've done in quite a while. Oh, okay, they cannot have our beaver den. We'll be back. We'll be back, mysterious geyser of warmth and wonder. We are going to go ahead and we are going to reclaim our beaver den. Or beaver dam, I should say. I guess a wolf would think of it as a beaver den. But we are going to reclaim it and prepare for a fight for territory next time. So if you guys could, do please go ahead and leave a like. Possibly to like sit close but not too close to the hot springs like if you want to go ahead and warm up there yeah just like don't no touch no touch that, that's a bad idea trust me uh <laughs> and if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures well good luck because you might have to have better senses on how to get around in our poor wolves but maybe you could figure out some way to go ahead and, and join our adventures so that you never lose them i don't know there could be a button but i don't pay attention to these things anymore I've been doing YouTube too long. I I've forgotten. Like, you know, those those little details, they escape me. <laughs> and I will stop being silly and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Stay curious.